And welcome to another episode of Peanut Better here on Reckless Eating. Mad Zion filmed the pumpkin spice Oreo review, which if you missed, you can click right there or go in the description for the link to get the review on them just by themselves. But now we're going to find out how they would taste with a little bit of PB. Let's put that PB right there, yep. Yep, oh, we got our Skippy Natural Singles. These are like, these were made for this show, specifically. They came to me and they were like, Matt, what can we do to help with you? And I was like, Skippy, just give me some go on the, that didn't make any sense. All right, Pumpkin Spice Oreo is pretty solid. Ah, super, super messy. <laughs> for some reason, this cream just gets all over the place. It's very strange. All right, we got our peanut butter, our Pumpkin Spice. Yeah, this is the ultimate fat ass show right here. Uh, okay, so will these be made peanut butter? We're gonna find out right now. Lots of chewing to commence. I really like the texture that you, when you put a little bit of peanut butter on Oreo that it creates. The pumpkin spice aspect, it kind of gets taken away. It just becomes a peanut butter Oreo. Just a hint of pumpkin in there, but not nearly as much when you have it by itself. The peanut butter in this case, it's just the dominant factor. Personally though, I do like it better than the pumpkin spice Oreos on its own, obviously. It becomes a peanut butter Oreo. I would say yes, I think that does work. I think it makes it better. But uh, but if you really want to get the flavors of the pumpkin spice Oreo, you should just try them on their own, obviously. But hey, another episode down the drain. Just uh, trying to have a little more variety. A lot of our like adding food to things shows kind of slowed down once we created Will It. So we're gonna pop a bunch in here and there. We got another one coming very soon. The caramel apple Oreos. Check back for that, and we'll see you on the next episode of Peanut Butter.